Okay, so what I'm going to do now is show you how you can install Visual Studio on a Chromebook. So I've logged into a Chromebook here, and one of the first things to do, uh, there's actually a couple different ways to do this, uh, and I might fumble through some of this, but uh, you got to go into the settings, and then scroll down here where it says Linux beta and you got to turn this on. Now some Chromebooks won't have this option uh, so I'll have to research another way to do this uh, if this doesn't show up. Uh, out of my kids three different Chromebooks two of them had this one of them didn't. Uh, the other thing you do if it, if it doesn't have it uh, go and make sure your Chromebook is up to date. Uh, I think you scroll down about Chrome OS and just make sure you've checked for updates, make sure you've updated to the latest one. Um, but let's go ahead and let's turn on uh, the Linux option here. I haven't actually done this before, so I'm going through this for the first time. Okay, I'm gonna just leave everything default. Okay, looks like we've got uh, Linux up and running in a Linux container on here. Okay, I'm gonna just give it a shot. So let's open uh, Chrome and let's search for uh, Visual Studio Code. And let's just jump straight to the download page. So this is code.visualstudio.com slash download. And we've got uh, a Linux option here in the middle. And let's go ahead and download the Debian version or Ubuntu. And it's going ahead and downloading. Let's show it in the folder. Now I gotta somehow try and run this. Okay, I, I just kind of double clicked or right clicked and I'll try install with Linux beta. And I'm just gonna click install. It looks like the install is going through. Okay, it says the app is now available. Maybe I'll click the icon in your launcher. Okay, I don't see a launcher anywhere. Um, this showed up. Um, <clears throat> Okay, let's just go back to our terminal. I wonder if um, Visual Studio Code. Nope. Okay. Uh, let me poke around a little bit and see if I can find it. If not, let me see if it showed up in a launcher or anything anywhere. Oh, maybe over here. Ah, here we go. Visual Studio Code. Minimize this. Okay, it looks like it's trying to load. Okay, this looks like it. I don't need to 
worry about that. So it looks like we have it up and running here. Um, and we've got all of our stuff. Let's see. Yeah, we would need to install some of those extra pieces in here as well now. But this is a good start. Fairly slow. Okay, looks like it does have the Alexa Skills Kit Toolkit. It does have, let's see if it has AWS, AWS Toolkit. So I think you just install straight from there. And that stuff should all work. Uh, so that should be it. That's how you, that's one way, the easiest way, I believe, to get uh, Visual Studio Code to run in your Chromebook. Uh, and then uh, the rest of the tutorial uh, for making an Alexa skill should uh, just kind of follow along uh, like uh, on a Windows machine.